So my name's Kavita Kapoor, or if you are from the north, Kavita Kapoor, I can almost say it. Um, I uh, wasn't going to put this slide in, but there was a couple of questions yesterday about uh, diversity within the agile community and certifications, et cetera, et cetera. So the next two slides come from that. I just wanted to give you a brief history of where I've come from. So, and also someone asked me if I was a marketing person yesterday. That kind of annoyed me. So I thought, hey, I would, um, I would tell you that I'm not a marketing person. I'm a technologist. I was a programmer. I'm slightly um, power hungry, as you would expect. So I became a project manager because I wanted all that power. Eventually, uh, I got introduced to DSDM, so meeting Yesterday, I, there was that presentation from the Welsh guy that's, who invented DSDM, so that was really exciting, um, which was pretty awesome. We did that at um, BBC, and I kind of got really excited about process, delivery, product, that kind of thing. A couple of jobs later, I found myself at Fig Leaves. If you don't know it, it's an underwear company. This is probably the least risque picture I could find for this presentation. and. Um, it, it, they introduced me to Agile. It was the most amazing experience I could have gone through. Lights. Um, mainly because there was plenty of underwear right around the office, and then a whole bunch of stickies on a big glass wall trying to explain what the website would deliver and when it would deliver it and whether it would ever deliver it. So this was for a new product that we wanted to deliver. It. Actually, it was a new pl platform that the team I was working with wanted to deliver. Um, so that's kind of a potted history of how I got into Agile. But I think the point I wanted to make was I haven't been certified in any sense of the word. Um, I've learned on the job, and I know that that's kind of slightly different from where we're coming from. Lond I know that London as an environment definitely values experience over qualifications. Um, but I do think it's really important to do. So I'm here to talk about hacking the sales process with Kanban and Agile. Um, I wanted to talk about it because I've been doing it for the last six and seven months. Um, it hasn't been a smooth process. So it's not been, if you're coming to this talk to find out how to do it for your own organization, probably won't have the answer for you. I'm sorry. But I can tell you how not to do it and how not to do the obvious things. So, but I'm also going to assume that you know nothing about my organization because we started two years ago. We started in 2013. We're a group of software developers. We're a group of software developers that all met at Fig Leaves as it happens. Um, we're all a little bit older, so we're all in our sort of um, 30s and 40s.